Hi everyone, this is Lyndon over at the Nexus 7 Soft Modder, and today we're going to take a look at how to transfer files wirelessly to your Nexus 7. Transferring files to the Nexus 7 can be difficult, uh, especially since sometimes it requires third party software, uh, specifically on the Mac. And uh, sometimes the USB cable isn't uh, available, whether you've lost it or the cable doesn't work. So uh, transferring files through the network uh, makes the process rather easy. So the first step is going to be downloading the AirDroid software by Sand Studio. It's free uh, and there is a premium service available which increases the uh, quota of remote transfer uh, and that is um, $20 a year or $2 a month. And uh, for the purposes of this tutorial we're going to use the just the plain free account. So you'll want to uh, open up the Play Store and download it. I've already downloaded it, so I'm going to open the application. And you'll see this screen where you are able to either sign into a existing account or register. For this tutorial I'm going to skip. And you'll see the IP address of the device and the uh, web URL to access remotely if you're on a different uh, network. Additionally, if you have the new Nexus 7, you can scan the QR code right here that is displayed on your computer. So for now, I'm going to switch to my computer and I will show you how to connect to the device. So now that you're on your computer, you'll have to go to the address where you can access AirDroid. You have two options. You can either use the web URL, which is web.airdroid.com, if your Nexus 7 is either off your network or somewhere else. Or you can use the IP address of the Nexus 7, which is also displayed on the home page of the application. Uh, for this tutorial, I'm going to use the IP address because you have uh, unlimited quota and it's much quicker and since I'm on the same Wi-Fi network as the Nexus 7 I can access it that way. So you'll see this screen where you'll have to accept on the device which I will do and then you'll see this screen on the device and this screen on your computer and this is the main home screen of AirDroid where you'll see different options such as apps, files, photos, music, and videos as well as additional functions which uh, the Nexus 7 does not support such as ringtones and messaging since it is not a phone. However, if you have other devices you can use those functions if you install AirDroid on that device. So for this tutorial I am going to quickly show how to upload a photo. So you're going to click on photos and all your folders will appear on this side of the panel. Uh, for this tutorial I'm going to upload into the screenshots folder on the device and you want to click on upload and you have two options you can either drag and drop files in this area or you can select files manually. So I'm going to drag and drop a file and you'll see it quickly uh, uploaded and it says success and when you cl click here you'll see the photo has been uploaded and if you want to download files from the device you can either check the boxes like so or you can uh, highlight this the photo you want to download and click on the bu download button and then if you use the check boxes, you'll have to click on this button, download. And you'll be prompted to save the file. And the files will be downloaded to your computer. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to our page. Uh, or check out the full tutorial available at our website. Thanks for watching.